be working from Unit 8, Lesson 10 today. We're moving right along with our lessons. We're going to get started with green time, and we're going to play our favorite word game with Mr. Lion. We help him practicing the whole words. He's still having a little trouble forgetting some sounds, though. So can you listen for the beginning sound and tell Mr. Lion which sound it is that he has forgotten to say? All right? Thank you so much for helping. You guys are the best. All right, Mr. Lion, you ready? Mm -hmm. All right. So the first word is going to be... Pie. Pie. I. 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 The word is pie. What sound is Mr. Lion forgetting to say? P sound. Mr. Lion, you are forgetting to say the P sound. Can you try again? Mm -hmm. Pie. That's right, Mr. Lion. Let's do one more word. How about, let's do lie. Lie. I. Mr. Lion, you forgot the beginning sound of that word. Do you guys know what the beginning sound is in the word lie? You're forgetting the L sound, Mr. Lion. Can you try again? That's right. Give him a hand. Clap it up. Woo -hoo. Good job, Mr. Lion. Keep practicing, okay? Okay, guys. Thanks for helping. Hugs. Hugs. I'm going to do the finger blame. Five years old. Do you remember? Five years old. It starts with, please, everyone, look at me. Today, I'm five years old, you see. You remember that finger play. We're gonna do it again, we're gonna use our fingers, but this time we're gonna really listen for those rhyming words, okay? So if you hear words that sound the same, I'm gonna stop and ask you what they are, okay? Here we go. Please, everyone, look at me. Today, I'm five years old, you see? Which word sounds like me? C. C and me sound the same. They rhyme. Let's keep going. And after this, I won't be four, not ever, ever, any more. I heard some rhyming words. Which words did you hear that sound the same? More and four sounds the same. They rhyme. Let's keep going. I won't be three or two or one, for that is when I first begun. Did you, did you hear it? Which word sounds the same as begun? One. <laughs> you got it. All right, last stanza. Now I'll be five for a while, and then I'll soon be something else again. Did you hear some rhyming words in that one? Go ahead and discuss the rhyming words amongst each other. We're gonna move right on. See you in the next one. Does anybody know what letter this is? This is our new letter. Tell me, tell me, tell me. What letter is this? It's the letter U. U, you are correct. I'm gonna turn it over. It is red. Why is the letter red? Do you remember why the letters are red? Because they are special. They are vowels, yes? So when we learn a vowel, we learn the long sound of the vowel so far, okay? So the long sound of a U, what do you think it would be? U, U makes a long U sound. Wow, did you know that? Let's sing our little check for when we learn our special vowels. It goes, give me a you, you, you got your you, you got your you, give me a you, you, you got your you, you got your you, you, you. What is that sound? You. <laughs> Good work, guys. Hi, kids. Well, it's time for us to pull out another sheet from our packet. This is page 124. You did something like this last time. Look at the letters. We have different letters this time. We have the letters D, capital D, lowercase d, capital E, lowercase e, capital F, lowercase f. 
Your job is to find out which letter is the correct way to write it. You're gonna look at the lines that are being used to make the letter. So look at D, D has an up and down line right here. And I also have a curve, a big curve. Which D is the correct way to write a D? This way? You put a circle around the D because this is correct. Let's go to the lowercase D. Which one is the right way to make a lowercase D? This one? Bah. This line is a slant. A lowercase D doesn't have a slant in it. What kind of line does a lowercase D have? A sh up and down line. So look closely at the letters of the alphabet. Look for a D, an E, and an F, and see if you can circle the correct ones. That's all, guys. Read, it's time to get ready to read. Look at all the pictures that you see. What are the sight words? See if you can remember what they say. Read, 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 read with me. What is the first sight word say? What is the first one right there say? On the left side. R. The is my, and this is our new sight word. Do you remember the name for our new one? Four. <laughs> Good memory. Nice try. Let's look at our pictures. What's the name of the picture in the middle? Pie. What is the name of the first picture that you see on the left side? Family. And the last picture is a picture of apples. Thank you for remembering and practicing. Let's see if we can make a sentence today. Can you read this sentence for me? The pie. You got it. Let's see if we can make another one. All right, here we go. We're gonna read this sentence right here. Are you ready? Let's start with the first word. My. Apples are for the pie. Can you read that sentence one more one more time by yourself? Good job. <laughs> Keep practicing. We'll do some more sentences next time.